you know I tell people when you find a tattoo artist you know you can't be um, intimidated of your tattoo artist is your tattoo artist a douchebag or is he somebody like I have a guy that you can trust and you can collaborate with and you can tell him you know this is what I you know this is what I want um, yada 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 you know like I told the guy just do whatever you want with the gears in here I trust you we collaborated on this doll and all that and um you know you have to be able to do they have a fucking attitude problem do they have a big ego or are they chill people you're looking for somebody that's secure in their shit their shop is clean okay they're going through all the, everything sterilized that goes without saying you're not going to a fucking tattoo party in a fucking garage somewhere out in the country and watching people you know like before you get a tattoo I, I wait and I think and I visualize and it usually about four or five months sometimes a year or more before I get it done you know and then you find an artist that is good as fuck and is legit and spiritually somebody that you can talk to and you guys you know vibe together and you have a good flow and a good working relationship and we're on the same page if you feel like the guy or girl is a dick at all walk away okay you don't want a tattoo artist doing what they want to do or their vision you want to share you know it has to be an equal thing for both parties it really does but you want to make sure that you can collaborate and you can't collaborate with just everyone you have to take your time and find a tattoo artist like I did in Buffalo he owns Arboreal Inc on Hurdle Avenue shameless plug he's the owner he's a fucking awesome guy he's easy to talk to I mean man we can talk you know you got to be able to talk you're sitting there for four hours Greg is the fucking the best I actually lost money on a tattoo because I put money down on this guy that was a douchebag. He rode his bike up into the shop, his Harley. He's all like, da 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 da, you know, um, this is how I would do it. I wouldn't do it like this. And, you know, there's nothing wrong with that, but we just didn't vibe. Then I met Greg, and he was like, oh, you know, you can't just walk in. You know, you got to make an appointment, you know, da 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 da. And I said, that's kind of a good sign. You got to make an appointment because they're busy. The guy that can just fit you in. Not that it's true in every case, but, you know, look at their work, you know, do the, do the research, you know, get something that you're going to end up liking, okay?